got a proposition for you. What can I do for you, Burgrind? Mourn my poor departed luck. I finally met some Banuk keen to trade with Outlanders. Then, they up and vanished. Three Banuk hunters rolled in a few days ago. No provisions, junk equipment, no idea how to strip a machine for parts. Asked me to outfit them for a long trip. You know me, Aloy. I'm sentimental. So, I did it on credit. And they haven't paid. Well, they tried. Just look what they did to this Thunderjaw heart. But that was ages ago. And I'm starting to worry about them. Tell me, Burgrind, are you worried about their well-being or your purse strings? A man can worry about two things. Uh-huh. What kind of deal was this, really? Just what I said. I was nothing but generous, Aloy. After they dropped this ruined heart at my feet, I even gave them another chance. Sent them to fetch a few other parts I need. But you haven't seen them since. <laughs> Hide nor hair. What do you mean they couldn't harvest parts? Not uncommon with Banuk. That's shaman's work, you see. The hunters take down the machines. The shamans slice them up. No shaman with these three. Just two youngsters sniping at each other. And that big fella. Standing there smiling. So if the Banuk don't usually hunt without a shaman, what's the story with these three? Mm, they weren't telling. But hammer to steel. It's not a happy story, whatever it is. You said they asked you to outfit them for a trip. A trip to where? Not sure. But I heard them chattering about the Sundom when they thought I wasn't listening. So they're leaving Banuk territory. Sensible behavior. Still, I get the sense this wasn't a sightseeing trip. They're running from something. I'm not a debt collector, Burgrind. If I look for them, it'll be to make sure they're all right. Of course, of course. Fires of the Forge, forgive me. I actually like these idiots. The molten steel of youth and all that. But uh, if you do manage to find them, you could remind them of the deal we made. <laughs> A Scorcher Claw, a loop of sinew from a Stalker, and a Snap Morphang. If they bring me those parts, their debt's paid. And then some. Just make sure they don't bust them up too badly. I'll... consider it. Last I saw them, they were heading northeast. Good machine hunting up that way. If you decide they're worth the trouble, you might look for them there. Stone Yield has always belonged to the... I don't suppose you three know an Osraman song's edge called Burgrin, do you? <laughs> Boys! That con artist sent an errand girl to collect what's owed to him. I'm nobody's errand girl. Burgrin asked me to help harvest parts. Or would you rather keep trying to sell him broken junk? Broken junk? This pack will be on the move soon. No time to argue. If she's offering to help, we should accept it. Fine. We're about to take down these machines. If you're so eager to help, then lead the way! Talk about our deal with Burgrind. Let's talk. That's done. You three are pretty handy in a fight. <laughs> Thanks, I guess. Not that we needed your help. We are doing just fine without you. That's not the way Burgrind tells it. He says you tried to settle up with him using a shattered Thunderjaw heart. What? That's an exaggeration. It was only broken in two. Urkai, we don't have time for this. Come on, boys, back to the hunt. We still need two more of Burgrind's components. What's the rush? We want out of these lands as soon as possible. That's all you need to know. Why are you leaving the cut? Well, we could go back to Baonor. Let Anakut slit our throats. By the blue light, Orkai. 
Why don't you just write our story in the snow for any passing hunter to read? We had a dispute with the chieftain of our old Werak. We thought someone else should have been in charge. He disagreed. It seemed like a good time to move on, so we are traveling to the Sundom. From here to the Sundom? It's a long trip. Seems worth it. Sometimes survival is about knowing when to leave and where to go. Yeah, and in this case, survival means us getting as far away as we can from Bonor. We've seen enough red snow. What's the plan once you get there? What will survival be about then? Look, all that matters is that we get that we need shards. So if you'll excuse us. So this Thunderjaw heart you brought Bergren. Let me ask you this, all right? Why would it matter that the heart was broken into two pieces? Can't you just stick it back together? Of course you can't just stick it back together. I just meant... Oh, I bet that scam artist Osirim could. He just wants to send us on another stupid errand. Oh, he's not so bad. I like Bergrind. Like him? Tulamak, he sent us out in the snow to nearly die under the feet of a Thunderjaw, and- Boys, shut up! Ugh. Every time someone brings up that stupid heart. I've got the Scorcher Claw Bergrin was asking for. That only leaves the Stalker Sinew and the Snap Mawfang. You should hold on to it. You're coming along to the next hunt after all, aren't you? I suppose somebody's gotta keep you three out of trouble. Fine. I guess you'll have to tag along then. But don't start thinking you're one of us. The bloody snowdrifts aren't accepting new hunters. <laughs> bloody snowdrifts? That's what you want to call our Warwick? Yeah, it's not great to die. Oh, it's, it's not like your names are any better. You. We're headed northwest, to the ruins near Hollow Hall. We'll be waiting. There's the herd. Everyone ready? <laughs> are you joking? We were born ready. Let's go get them, Flaming Skulls. Nope. That's awful. It is a pretty bad name. Good effort to work, I. Forget it. Let's just go kill something. know about you three, but I feel better. Aloy, did you get that component? That's another part down. One more and you'll have what you need to pay off Burgrind. Starting to feel real, you know. I'm starting to believe we're really gonna get out of here. Honestly, I wasn't sure we'd survive a week without Nikoni. But here we are. Who's Nikoni? Nikoni... Nikoni was... She was a friend of ours. She challenged the chieftain for control of our... of the Werak. She didn't make it. No. If you're gonna tell this story, tell it true. She was murdered. Is this why you left Benor? Because of this business with Nikoni and your chieftain? Onika knew Nikoni was our mentor, our friend. We couldn't stay. That final night, we snuck back to camp, packed what we could, and left. Like cowards. What are we to tie? We are Banuk, aren't we? Survive and prevail. That's what we do. It's not what she did. Nikoni challenged the chieftain. Why? Only Cup wrapped himself in power and authority the way some people wrap themselves in furs. If you were willing to fawn over him and sing false songs to him, you might get a spot on the best hunts. The Werax split into two. Those were the things that get better. Until Nikoni. She was the best and bravest of us. She was the one who took a stand. What happened? 
How did you lose Nakoni? She challenged the chief into a hunting competition. Oni could damn him. He wasn't nearly the hunter Nakoni was. But who comes back to the camp after the trial? Oniku, grinning like a snap maw, crowing, Oh, where's little Nakoni? We tracked Nakoni through the woods, found her not far from the trailhead. But their damn neck snapped. I don't want to remember her like that. Sometimes that memory, it's all I can think of. I'm sorry, Tatai. It sounds like she meant a lot to you. To all of you. I'm sorry for what you've been through. It's nice to be here. Thank you, Amber. Look, it doesn't matter, okay? What happened in Bonowar is buried in Bonowar. What matters now is what happens in the Sundom. That's where the burning turkeys are gonna make a name for ourselves, right? Oh, the burning turkeys? Seriously? It rolls off the tongue. Sort of like vomit? So, where to next? There's a lake just west of here. Seems like a good place to find a snap mall thing. We'll meet you there. If you beat us there, just wait by the campfire. We'll be along. No sign of him yet. I guess I'll just sit and wait. I was starting to worry about you three. Everything all right? We took our time. After our last conversation, we had a lot to think about. I can imagine. Just one more hunt, then your debt is paid and you three can make your way south. Ready? Huntress, the sunshine snowshoes await your signal. <laughs> <laughs> Horrible! I'm almost impressed, Dulamok. Didn't think you could come up with a name worse than Burning Turkeys. Well, I liked it. Let's hunt. That's the last of Bergren's parts. Looks like you three are out of debt. For now. Until Orkai breaks something else. It was one time! You make a nice chant. Maybe we'll meet you in the Sundom sometime. Once you get to the Sundom, what then? What's the next step? We hunt like Nakoni wanted to hunt. Nakoni had big dreams. A werak in which everyone pulls their weight and takes care of each other. No shamans, no chieftains. No need to pry the power out of anybody's hands. Sounds like a lot of work. Mm, but worth it, I think. In a fitting tribute to Nukoni, we can become the Werak she always wished for. You won't have me to strip your kills now. Are you three gonna be all right? Eh, uh, doesn't look that hard, really. We'll be fine. <sighs> Great. He washes three successful harvests and he's suddenly a shaman. When you get to Song's Edge, talk to Burgrind. If he can't teach you himself, he'll know someone who can. Sure. And I bet he charges us for the introduction. Uh, thank you, Aloy. I'm sure we'll figure it out. I guess this is goodbye. How does it feel, putting Banu glands behind you? The only thing I would have missed is already gone. Let all those rotten Bonor suck-ups freeze to death. That's a little much, Urkai, don't you think? That's strange. What is it to be Banuk after Banur forsakes you? How do we decide who we are? How about you, Aloy? Who do you think we are? What will you remember of us? 
You lost someone you care about. That leaves a wound. The sort of wound a lot of people don't recover from. Yeah. I've got no- Only survivor scar. After everything you've been through, you keep going. We're the Scars of the North. Scars of the North. Sounds pretty tough, doesn't it? Thank you, Aloy. It's a good name. One we'll honor. I wonder what they'll trade for Blue Gleam. Bergrind, how'd your investment pay out? Quite handsomely, thanks very much. You know those three crazy Banuka calling themselves the Scars of the North now? <laughs> well, now that I have those parts, I can pay off a debt of my own. So they've gone south then? Aye, that they have. I've got a friend in the Sundom by the name of Otur. He owes me a vest. Or at least from the pretty competent. Well, we work with the resources we have. Speaking of which, here, a token of my gratitude. If you run into the scars of the North again, send them my regards. <laughs>